Hello beloved, today I have come to share the revelation of the 18th of July 2021, it was in the morning prayer and it was 10 when I got this encounter, while we were having the service my spiritual eyes were opened and I saw that the Lord had deployed many type of angels inside the church, and among them there was a particular angel that caught my attention. I noticed that each of these angels were in hurry and agitated, there was actually a spiritual combat that was taking place in the church against the devil of evil thought, that was hell bent to attack our mind with unnecessary thought while we were praying, for most often during the service people think about many things instead of being concentrated, finally I saw the demon of evil thought, he was ugly and hideous, and this demon was bent, like in the movie Beauty and the Beast. This devil was exactly the same character that is portrayed in the movie Beauty and the Beast, he was covered by black hair, a viscous liquid that smelled bad covered him, he was really disgusting, he normally move and stand with four paw, however when he stood up to observe me he stood with two paw like a human wanting to attack us with distracting thought, very quickly I saw that members of our church in this prayer meeting were inside a circle and thanks to this circle the demon could not attack us with his evil thought, this circle that surrounded us was luminous and burning, since this beast was unable to launch and shoot evil thought to reach us, I saw that he was roaring in anger and was furious for being powerless and unable to stop our prayer with his thought, this devil of evil thought was defeated and there was nothing he could do against us, while he was roaring and grunting in rage because of defeat, I saw a lady in the neighborhood sitting beside the door of his house, she was thinking about life and what to do during the day, it was made known to me that the lady was not a believer for she was not born again. She goes to bar and night club and she live life the way she want, the Lord was not his master, while she was thinking about life, this furious devil of evil thought came to her, the demon stood before and pointed his index finger on this lady brain. As a result I saw in the spirit this lady head and brain opening, immediately this beast entered the lady brain and made his habitation inside her head, actually this devil looked for a place to dwell in the body of this pagan lady but could not find empty peace, because of her ways of life this lady was indwelled by all manner of demons that control his life, her body was full of demon, the only place available for the devil of evil thought was found in the lady brain. As soon as the demon enter her brain and made his seat there, this lady became unstable and began to attack verbally people that were in her proximity, such as her child and husband, moreover she was going back and forth agitated and speaking in a rude way, when this demon made his home in the brain of this lady, first he began to inject all sort of thought, then he quickly began to invite and call others demon to join him, first he called the spirit of hate. When the spirit of hate came, he called the spirit of anger, the spirit of anger called the spirit of bitterness and the spirit of bitterness called the spirit of hypocrisy, the devil of hypocrisy called the spirit of lies, and the spirit of lies called the spirit of vengeance, and the spirit of vengeance called the spirit of death, after calling these unclean spirit, I saw these devils that came from hell to make their habitation inside this woman. After inviting these demon to my surprise the devil of evil thought left the woman and went away to seek another victim in order to possess him. His main purpose was to reach a born again believer, while he was seeking an empty body in the church neighborhood, he found a Christian lady that was doing housework, however, I saw that the lady was barricaded by a heat, that was burning in high degree, as a result this demon was unable to reach this lady. The Christian lady was actually singing song of praise and worship while she was doing housework. The song of praise and worship she was singing was producing a powerful protective heat that that was stopping this unclean spirit. Nevertheless, the demon was thinking and trying to figure out a way to reach the lady. Finally this demon went back to the pagan lady he had possessed previously. This devil influenced and manipulated the pagan lady to come and cause trouble to the Christian lady. The first issue is that this Christian lady has failed to dedicate his day to God through morning prayer, she just woke up and began to do housework, she has failed to do morning prayer to dedicate her day to God, given that she has failed to control the day through morning prayer she was not ready for battle, when her neighbor the pagan lady came to provoke her, this Christian lady lacked vigilance and could not withstand pressure of provocation, 
the Lord always look at our reaction when test and temptation come, beloved, we must learn to distinguish the person provoking and persecuting us from the spirit behind him, we must rebuke the spirit behind the person coming against us, however the lady reacted badly in this provocation, failing to discern a spirit acting behind her neighbor, thus she failed to exercise self-control, she was offended, aggravated and got angry, and she started quarreling and arguing with the pagan lady, as a result the Lord withdrew his protection and she became vulnerable and exposed, anger is fatal in Christian life, anger is the defeat and downfall of many saints, this lady has opened access to this devil of evil thought that enter in her body through the heart, because anger is an issue of heart, while the body of the pagan lady was full of demon and there was no place for this devil and he had to dwell in the head, and fact that the body of the pagan lady was full of demon yet this devil still had to call other demon to join him is telling, and when this demon entered the body of this Christian woman, he saw that her body was empty, the place for him to dwell was clean, adorned and arranged, as a result this demon settled in her body and began to call other demon, I saw in hell demons that were agitated, they left a prison of hell and came to dwell in this lady, before entering the body of this lady these evil spirit were asking permission to the devil of evil thought. He was the one who won the battle to enter and indwell this lady, this devil had become the master of this temple, and before letting his fellow demons in the body of this woman this devil made these demon of hell to swear to be obedient to him, I saw that they did not oppose him for they agreed to swear obedience to him, they are eager to enter and settle in the body of this woman. Then the Lord showed me another group of demons coming out of a dark pit, the place was actually the bottomless pit, before leaving the bottomless pit demon were presenting ticket to evil power guardian of the entry of the bottomless pit, as a result they were allowed to leave and rise to the surface for there was a body available on the land to enter and settle in, these demon of the bottomless pit were heading to the body of this Christian lady, the ticket they were showing the guardian of the pit was the legality to enter her body. Among these demon were ancestral spirit, generational spirit, that transmit from generation to generation, and the familiar spirit that operate and control families from paternal and maternal side, there were also unclean spirit that she let in her life since the age of accountability, all these unclean spirit were cast out of the life of this lady when she was born again, and they were imprisoned in the bottomless pit. As soon as the devil of evil thought found legality to enter this lady body, immediately he invited all these evil spirit that were previously cast out of the lady to return and settle again, when all these devils enter the life of this lady she became deviant and backslidden, she turned cold and could no longer go to church, brethren came to exhort her to come back to church but she hardened her heart, over time she developed thought pattern that she could no longer control and she fell in depression and she died without repenting, when this woman died all these demons left her body, however three of them remain, this was the demon of evil thought who was the chief demon in her life, secondly the demon of quarreling that caused her downfall and conquer her soul when she gave and the pagan woman provocation, the day of quarreling with her neighbor was the fatal day of her life, it was her downfall because she opened the gate of her life to demon. The third demon that remain was the demon of rebellion that manipulated her to harden her heart to the call of the brother to return to church, the spirit of rebellion prevented her from returning to the Lord, when she died I saw a big hole opening on the ground right beneath her feet and she fell to the center of the earth in hell with the three demons that were supposed to bear witness and testify against her. When they were falling in hell these demon began to torment her in the heart and the brain for these were the place of his body where these demon made their habitation, she could not do anything except scream of pain and she was begging, and the vision ended there.